Critiquing Christian content can sometimes be taboo, but this right here is my review. It's been a long time coming, but I'm back now. Quarantine kind of has me really creative since I can't go anywhere else. Today, we are going to be reviewing Lecrae's brand new song and music video, Set Me Free, featuring a very special artist. Who knew this collaboration could happen? Let's dive right into it. How many people with him they know in more than a year? Gotta move smart, got something to lose. No, no, no way. No, no, please. Ooh, that's kind of a mysterious opening. I wonder who the people at the table represent. Like, they're representing the industry, they're representing critics, they're representing, you know, uh, a hierarchy of Christian leaders. Like, who are they representing here? Um, but let's see how it goes. Oh, no, no! <laughs> Ooh. Yo, <laughs> hey, boss. This is what I have been waiting for. Sample old school Christian music and throw it into the song, man. This we need more of this. Shackles off my feet, Mary Mary. I was interested to see how they're gonna put YK in the song. Um, if he's gonna have a verse or a chorus, I thought he would just do the chorus, but we'll see what he's gonna do here. Shackles on my beat. I can't take no more, so miss me with that drama. Get your commas, get your red straight, get your fat straight. First off, off the bat, the set design and the amount of detail that went into the characters, and I can kind of see where the storyline is going here. I am very much so pleased. That's that's a Big ups, big ups on that one. I can see the story visually, which is a lot of times lacking in a lot of Christian music videos. So I guess the people who are enslaved represent maybe the rapper community and I guess they're bound in some kind of way. I don't know if that's industry bound or spiritually bound per se. Um, but it seems like they're bound in some way and they're trying to be crowd pleasers in a, in a way. I don't know. This is a, this is a different storyline. And I like that. Is this not your regular post in the alley? Let's shoot a music video or here's the behind the scenes of my concert. Let's shoot a music video. Like this is actually thought provoking. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They use YK appropriately on this song no verse yet we're two minutes into the song no verse from yk quite yet but i love the shot selection that they're choosing the whoever does cinematographer was for this did an excellent job and shout out to the editors um it looks beautiful like it just i like the setting i'm really digging the setting you know what? This is this track is Lecrae featuring YK and YK's glasses. <laughs> it's like every other shot, they're on, they're off, they're on, they're off. That's funny to me, bro. <laughs> he was eating on grapes, won't he? <laughs> that i'm i like the song i really like the song sometimes mainstream artists when he when he or she pairs with a chh artist it, it it can feel forced or it can feel like off a little bit but that one felt good the music video matched the production of the song that is so important but let's get to the review to me this video is creative because it used a narrative that made you think it used some common elements that you can kind of piece together. Um, the way it was shot, the way it was laid out, the costume design, the set design, the props that were used. Like this, this video definitely gets a big one for me for creativity. Now, as far as storytelling, there's a little bit of mystery there. Not really definitive, kind of a mystery there as far as 
who are the slaves and who are the masters or who are the people who are oppressed and who are the people who are kind of well off in this video. It's kind of hard to define who they are, but from my interpretation, it seems like they are kind of like the music industry, maybe. Maybe Lecrae is speaking to his shackles being broken as far as what the industry of music people think his music should be or what it should sound like because the first slaves were rapping to these this panel of judges per se and the first guy failed you know so i was like hmm maybe they're listening for something and they're not getting it from him it kind of speaks to the music industry vibe is what i'm getting anyway also too you can kind of see where yk and uh lecrae were kind of locked in the cages at the beginning of the film and then towards the end of the film they were the ones that were mastering the table um they kind of freed everybody everybody's free everybody's free to do what they want they now get to eat at the table so they have a seat at the table you know which is kind of like um where i feel like lecrae's career has gone he went from being an outsider to having a real seat at the table and he's able to eat you know what i'm saying and lastly shot selection shot selection was excellent it wasn't a still tripod camera it felt engaging nice smooth shots like i said y'all know i the scenes to me are the best it was like it was shot in about three locations it was like the prison and then it was like the the table and then it was the hallway where they were so to wrap up my conclusion let's go ahead and rate this off bat this song is definitely going into my playlist having yk only on the chorus was actually a really good decision like we didn't necessarily need a verse from him but he showed up enough in the song to have a prominent presence to rate this based on our three criteria i would give this music video, you know, eight broken shackles out of 10. This is a very, very, very well put together music video. So shout out to you guys for uh, pulling this off. It's amazing. Thank you guys for sticking around and listening to my review of Lecrae's song, Set Me Free, featuring YK. Now, this is not the only review I have on this channel. There are other reviews that you should check out. So if you haven't already, like, share, subscribe in that order so you will never miss another review. But for right now, go get that song. See y'all.